welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna be doing a video of what's in my diaper bag video um, if you don't know I am a first-time mom um, I have a daughter her name is Zoe Faye and she is almost three months she will be three months on the 3rd of February so this is a first-time mom um, what's in my diaper bag so don't judge me this is what I found works for me and Zoe when we step out of the house so without further ado let's just get started so first things first is that since she's still a newborn she drinks warm milk she is drinking formula I'm not breastfeeding um, so I need to have warm water with me at all times. The best way I found to um, keep water warm while we're on the go is just the turvis. So I have a turvis here. Just a regular turvis. You can get it from Walmart, Target, wherever. Dollar Tree even sells them, I think. Um, and I just warm water up in her bottle warmer. And then I pour the water in here and it keeps it um, warm for for a long time, up to eight hours, I think. So I've never been out that long with her because she is still fairly young, but this works, this really works. So I keep this with me. Um, I keep this with me on the side here. And by the way, my um, bag is a diaper bag backpack. So it's the Land Mommy and Baby Bag. And I got it on Amazon. Um, I believe it was no more than $35. I will link it down below. Um, it's a dupe for the um, Fawn Design Bag. So I was looking at the Fawn Design Bag, which is another um, backpack diaper bag brand. And they run for like a hundred and something dollars. I just wasn't willing to pay that much for a diaper bag. So I looked up dupes on Amazon and I found this one and it works really, really good. It's a backpack so it's very convenient so your hands are free. I feel like the um, backpack system just works better for me because it keeps my hands free so that I can deal with Zoe um, just more easily. So I'll link it down below if you want to check it out. It was no more than um, $35 I believe. On the other side, I keep something for myself. I keep a water bottle um, and also I keep this just in case I run out of water in her thermos um, just to have some extra water you can never have too much water you always want to make sure you have water when you're um, formula feeding your baby so I'm gonna open it and in the inside I have this now this is a um, snack and formula um, separator like portioner um, so basically it looks like this and it has like let me take the top off it has three different sections Ooh, <laughs> it has three different sections on it and um, you just basically portion out the amount of formula that you need to make for your baby's bottle and you put it in each uh, section. You pop on the top and when you're ready to um, mix your baby's bottle, you just pop the top up here and then you just pour the portion of um, formula in the bottle. So I find this very, very, very convenient. Very convenient and it was $3 at Walmart. I'll link it down below, but it was $3 at Walmart. I forget what brand it was, but I'll find I'll find it on Walmart.com and I'll link it down below. So this formula portioner is a must-have in my diaper bag. Next is bottles. So Zoe, she uses um, the Tommy Tippy bottles. Um, I've been using these ever since she's been born and she hasn't had any problem with it so I haven't switched it up it's not broke don't fix it so I have the two Tommy bottles and I have a nine ounce bottle and a five ounce bottle she's currently um 
taking four to five ounces. So I keep at least two in my bag um, so that I can feed her while we're out. The next thing I have is of course a must have in every diaper bag and that is diapers and wipes. So she uses the Huggies brand diapers and wipes. Um, she's in a size one right now, um, but she's quickly growing out of that. <laughs> but for right now, she's in a size one. And then I have the Huggies wipes. So they just look like this, just some regular Huggies wipes and some regular diapers. And then focus. Yep, just, oh, these are the Pampers brand. But um, she started using, it won't focus, but she started using the Huggies brand diapers. But I guess these are just the ones that I had left over. So I'm just using these up. Also, I have for her in her diaper bag on the side here is some boogie wipes. So these days, I think she's in the early stages of teething, which is crazy because she's only like three months. But she's always spitting up and she's always slobbering. She's always got boogers in the nose and snot and stuff when she's crying. So these boogie wipes, I keep. And I got those from the Dollar Tree, actually, for a dollar. It's the travel size pack, but they do sell the full size in Walmart. And then... In this little compartment here, I have just a container. I had like a little snack for me in there. Not supposed to be in there, but I have this little compartment here. I keep just a towel because you never know when you need to wipe up something, some spit up or anything, dry off a bottle anything so I keep this rag um, in there also I keep a um, travel bottle washer because if I use up um, both her bottles but she wants another bottle and we've been out for a long time I will if I'm somewhere where there's a sink or a restroom or something like that I would just rinse the bottle out and scrub out the old formula so that she can have a fresh fresh enough bottle then so that was in this compartment and then in this other compartment I have a boogie a boogie getter <laughs> I don't know what these things are called let me just so it's a booger thing that you put in the nose and you squeeze and it gets the boogers out because I don't know about you guys but my baby girl has lots of boogers so I keep this boogie thing so she won't be congested now we have gotten all the compartments now it's time to see what's in the bottom it's very spacious this I really like this because it's very spacious but let's see what's in the bottom here so in the bottom here I always keep for her a um, extra bib so this is just like a cheetah bib um, it's the child of mine by Carter's brand and I believe you get this from Walmart and I believe you can find it at Target as well so I like that brand um, so I keep with her extra bib I have a bow for her, usually she's wearing something on her head anyway, but I just have a bow in there for her, on her head. I have for her an extra hat because it is winter here in Chicago. So I have for her an extra hat. Just in case you can never be too safe. I have for her two extra pairs of socks. So they're just two extra pairs of socks, just in case you need another pair of socks. You never know, you can never be too safe with babies. I have for her two changes of clothes. So I always like to take um, 
changes the clothes just in case she has a poop explosion and she messes up her clothes by any chance. So I just keep two pairs just to be on the safe side. Two pairs of change of clothes. And also I keep a receiving blanket. Now, I use this receiving blanket um, for if we're in a public place like a mall or something like that and I have to change her diaper and go to the public restroom and use those tables, I lay this down first because I don't want my bare baby's bum on those things where a lot of the babies and germs been on it. They don't clean them properly probably so I just want to be on the safe side. I know that they do have little um, like mats that you can buy. Um, to put down on those uh, surfaces but this is an affordable way these work just as well I just keep this and then I just switch them out every time that we go out and I use this I switch out so that's what I have and actually is that it oh last thing I have her two um, pacifiers now my daughter she does not suck pacifiers she's never really been fond of them um but i keep them just in case just in case she gets really 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 fussy and i'm very very desperate i will try i will try the pacifiers but i keep those in there and in the front so i have a compartment here in the front and i keep my stuff in the front so i keep my wallet I have the Savvy Sense wallet. It's a, like a cash system wallet, so I have that. And I also have um, some pain medication, just in case I need pain medication for any reason. You never want to be anywhere and you catch a headache or cramps or anything like that. So I just keep some medicine. And that is all for what's in my diaper bag again this is the land mommy and baby bag um and i got it from amazon i will link it down below it was no more than 35 or 40 dollars it is a backpack diaper bag and it's very spacious in the inside and i love it i really do love it and this can um transfer to a toddler bag as well so it'll grow with your child so i really really like this and that is what's in my diaper bag for a first time mom if you enjoyed this video please like comment and subscribe and then you can follow me on my social media my social media will be up here somewhere the subscribe button is down there i think so go ahead feel free if you enjoy lifestyle mommy beauty hauls reviews i do it all on this channel if you enjoy those type of videos then just go ahead and subscribe thank you so much for watching bye